All right, y'all. How y'all doing? <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, yeah, so this is just kind of like an update video. Um, what I've been doing is, uh, I've been reading the dictionary as I have, and, uh, and I got to the word gestating, and, uh, this was when I was on G, I'm on, I'm now on I, but, um, I got to the word gestating, and, uh, it's, honestly, it's, <laughs> to be honest, it's a new word to me, but, um, uh, and then I thought about Jesus, and then I thought about the the um, the al prefix. So therefore, you got as then you kind of have um, the word Almighty. You um, and as we do all things through Christ, as we gain strength, gain might from the Almighty. Um, it's the same thing with women uh, in gestating. So when it comes to women being pregnant. Um, the the all gestating Christ Jesus, <laughs> so therefore, um, as Jesus had to do everything before us, um, as then Jesus is then words before, um, before we um would understand words, um, we then see him through Jesus Christ, and uh, as, especially with the al prefix, so just like with the term Almighty, um, you then have uh Jesus being all gestating, all menstruating, and all ovulating and anything else. So therefore, um if if people are following uh the as as I'm following the AL prefix, um as when it comes to using the AL prefix just just as it would be almighty as we gave as we are mighty from the Almighty, as we gain strength from the Almighty is is basically the same thing. Um, so therefore, since men can gestate, menstruate, or ovulate, then, then, uh, dang, <laughs> sorry about that. So then, uh, that means, uh, that means, uh, Jesus is a woman. <laughs> Jesus is also a woman, and just as, uh, Jesus would then be, hold on, uh, Jesus, as Jesus would then be, uh, Dang, <laughs> this is doing this. Sorry, y'all. Uh, but uh, uh, it just says Jesus would be all estrogen. Uh, for women to have estrogen, it's the same as Jesus would be all testosterone. All testosterone for uh, for uh, men to have testosterone, right? So, so yeah, that's that's then kind of what I'm getting. Uh, let's uh, we can just kind of look at it and and this little uh. And what I and what I wrote up, so yeah, it just as um, Jesus is, um, just as Jesus is, uh, just as Jesus is Almighty. Uh, dang. Uh, what am I trying to do? Uh, anyways, dang, this is not. Yeah, just as Jesus is Almighty. Uh, then and and uh, we gain might from the Almighty, and women then uh, gestate um, in likeness of the uh, gestating. Men, women then menstruate uh, in likeness of the uh, menstruating, and then ovulate by the in likeness of the uh, ovulating. So therefore, Jesus then has to be, uh, in my opinion, has to then be both male and female. Uh, that's then what I'm getting, and uh, so uh. So yeah, y'all. Um, hold on. Um, so yeah, kind of like what we're getting to is is um is is like this is um this is just a lot of notes being taken. Dang, I'm sorry. This is just a lot of notes being taken. Um, and when it comes to my walk with Christ, my journey with Christ. Um, this is just a lot of notes being taken. Uh, behind uh using the al prefix. And uh, kind of drawing from the idea of Jesus being Almighty, um, and so therefore Jesus had to then then be these words um, in order to in order for people to be in likeness of these words. So um, as I'm kind of gaining understanding um, when it comes to uh, Jesus Christ being our Word, our blood, and our Spirit, um, for us to be for human beings. Uh, as males and females to be in likeness of Christ, um, 
we then have word, blood, and spirit. So I'm not at this point. I'm not really sure if if that is if that's what defines a human being having a soul. Maybe somebody else can kind of come up with that, or maybe later, uh, maybe later that can be understood. But um, for what I'm understanding, in order for human beings to be in likeness of God, we then have a word, blood, and have word, blood, and spirit in likeness of Jesus Christ being all holy, all word, all blood, and all spirit. Right. So um. So yeah, we then just kind of drawing from Christ in such ways. So so therefore, I'm, I'm then kind of still kind of up in the air when it comes to the idea of the as uh, as uh, a video I did previously when it comes to the uh, the Holy Trinity uh, or at least the All Holy Trinity. So it's just kind of like I'm not really sure if uh, if it's um, the uh, All Father, our Mother. Uh, sorry. I'm not sure if it's our father and our mother and uh <clears throat> and uh our um uh Jesus Christ being the daughter and the son and uh and then Jesus Christ being the all holy, all word, our blood and our spirit. Um it seems as if it has to be that way. Um at this point in time, it really does, um, simply because we all have to worship Jesus and, and then everything that we are comes directly from Jesus. So, so if we get, we get, um, so from what we get from the term almighty, we then have our word, our blood and our spirit, um, just as a person has their own word, blood and spirit. Um, it comes directly from from the our word, our blood, our spirit being Jesus Christ. So um so therefore um no one it like and when it comes to describing this video or talking about this video, no one can actually be Jesus Christ, starting from the rooting from the idea of Jesus being Almighty, right? So um so that's that's then kind of what I'm getting. Uh, still guys, um, this is, this is just, this is my walk. This is my journey. Um, and, uh, and I pray, I, I pray for everybody, um, to see the All Holy 16 perspectives as they are. Um, uh, recently, uh, I, I was blessed to understand to, in order to, um, write my rhymes, uh, my music, um, in a way to write it just as the All Holy 16 perspectives are. So, um, so instead of kind of placing stuff here and there about God in my work, um, I then, I'm then, what I'm doing is, uh, kind of going from the, the top being from blessed and blessing all the way to, lost and found therefore being on your journey with christ um with the all holy 16 perspectives so um that's then a little bit of update on me and uh and then what i figured out about um uh jesus being also being woman right so um so yeah um so as as you can as it can be understood, it has to everything draws from Christ and Jesus, and then using the al prefix, the al prefix is then that word um, that actually means it actually means it, that we draw from Jesus from right. Um, so that's that's then all I'm getting y'all, and uh, that's that's what I got. So um, I made a video update. Um, so yeah, y'all still reading the dictionary. I'm on letter I. Uh um I J and K is really short. Um uh there are a total of about fifty pages, so I should be I should be at about L in about maybe three weeks or so. Uh, as long as I can read on schedule. Uh, so yeah, so we're getting through it. Uh that's 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 all I got. So I, I'll catch y'all on the next video. Bye. And...